but were really poor on Friday night and their much changed team reflects that Naldo has been out for a month with a shoulder problem he returns to central defense Luis Gustavo is back in holding midfield alongside Joshua Guilabogui a motivated loanee from Atletico Madrid Bruno Enrique a January arrival from Brazil makes his European debut on the right Andre Schürrle leads the line Max Cruz well, on the whole, you'd be disinclined to alter a team which, even reduced to 10 men, has just beaten the European champions on their own ground. Sure enough, Zinedine Zidane asks 10 of his triumphant new Camp 11 to go again. The only change is at right back to Nilo for Danny Carvajal. In eight Champions League games this season, Real Madrid have scored 23 goals. Ronaldo 13, Benzema 4, the rest 6. Gareth Kling all whites in another semi final. If not that, then stand by for one of the great upsets. The thrill, the free saw, and now Kroos, back on very familiar territory for him. Benzema, Ronaldo, what about it? Oh, the flag is up, but that is the ever-present danger. What an unbelievable start that would have been. Wolfsburg yet to touch the ball. He's just gone a fraction early. I think his head's offside. He could obviously score with his head, therefore it's the right decision. Marcelo bails on his way now, scooting away from Biarina and nicking it in for Ronaldo. He has the ball stolen off his toe by Diego. That final counts for rather a lot as well, but this is certainly their biggest European game. And they're on the attack here with Draxler, who's floated a delicious ball to Bruno Enrique. His head up into the waiting arms of Keylor Navas. They are vulnerable to the counter-attack Real Madrid. You see there, they're on the attack, they lose possession, and then it's two against two. Traxler against Pepe, and a ball to the back post. Never going to beat Navas from there, the form. He's in, not conceded a goal yet in the Champions League. Enrique at the back post, but we have option. Kroos, Benzema, Casemiro. Slid through for Benzema, face to face with Dante. Benzema, good plunging save, Bell sliced across it and wide. Brilliant save from Benalio there. You know, Ronaldo was screaming from the ball from Benzema. Decided to go on his own. He easily went past Dante on his unfavoured left foot. But the trailing leg of Benalio just gets enough on it. Good save. And Bale on his left foot. You know, just couldn't get the right technique. But you see here, goes past Dante. Little step over. Goes to that far corner. And just the trailing left foot of Benalio, very good save. There's Gustavo, Rodriguez. Schürrle, Bruno Enrique. That's the goal, but didn't really concern Kayla Navas. Just oh. high towards Draxler. You can worry Danilo here. It's Draxler's pullback. Schürrle's gone to ground. And the referee has given a penalty against Casemiro. Bemused, disbelieving. It's a big intervention from the Italian official. And it is a massive opportunity for the rank outsiders. It's Casemiro getting back into that defensive midfield. I think... Rodriguez scores, and the Wolfsburg dream is alive, and the ten times European champions are behind, and 30,000 Germans spend the moment in paradise. Fantastic penalty, the first time Navas has had to pick the ball out of the Champions League. Just little pause, little stutter, side foot into the... Far corner, sends Navas the wrong way. Cool penalty. As you can see, the fans going mad. 1-0 up against Real Madrid in your first quarter-final. Fantastic stuff from the Germans. So what Barcelona did last night for many years to come. 
Draxler. Running away from Modric. Picking up Bruno Enrique. And set in for Maxi Arnold! It is a heavenly start to the tie for Wolfsburg! It is happening! It's really happening! Two up inside 25 minutes. Oh dear, oh dear, Marcelo got sucked in to Schürrle and then he doesn't get out to the ball quick enough. It's a great run across Ramos from Arnold. Great ball in from Enrique. Ramos on his heels, Schürrle, Arnold attacking it. Only one winner there, Ramos poor again defensively. 2-0 in dreamland, the Germans. Well, where has this come from? Dieter Heck. But it's going to be exciting watching them try. And here goes Schürrle. Bruno Enrique alongside. Andre Schürrle. Kayla Navas falls on it. Benzema. Bale. Skipping away from Viarina with ease. Bale's cross. Benzema's header. Magnificent from Bale. Just give him the ball, leave him on that left-hand side. Great little pull back to the back post. He meets it well, Benzema, but he just can't jump high enough and guide it past Benaglio into that far corner. Eight. Taken back by Marcelo. Out again by Naldo. Down once more by Marcelo. Cross has had a go. And uh, Benaglio did well to keep hold. Exactly. There was a few Real Madrid players bearing. And now also by Casemiro. It's Gareth Bale. Didn't come down as sharply as it went up. Should let Ronaldo take it. <laughs> the goals for that free kick, the one like Payet hitting so well now for West Ham and before the game believe that he has to score again settle for what he has and Casemiro bit a bit harder it's come to Tony Kroos who's hooked it over on his weaker left foot 30 yards out just got under the ball Michael Owen stayed on the bench that night here's Bale Threatening Viarina again. Bale's ball across and Ronaldo's slightly scuffed goal with effort. Can't turn through the centre circle. Casemiro prevented him from doing that. Kroos, Marcelo let it run. Bale now. Bale with an early cross. And, uh, Cristiano Ronaldo with an errant header. Wonderful ball from Bale. He's been the biggest threat for Real tonight. But Rodriguez just done enough there. He was wrong side, just got back and put enough pressure on Ronaldo. Cristiano Ronaldo. Can be such a delight to watch on his day. This goal in his stead and Schürrle looking to burst through here. Ramos did just about enough. And now our counter is on. Bruno Enrique with Draxler up alongside. Isco labouring to get back. Bruno Enrique kept it from him and fed Andre Schala. Massive, massive chance, which got away in a trice. Again on the counter attack, Real Madrid all over the place. Shambolic defending. Great ball from Enrique. I thought Schürrle was getting it the first time, took the turn. This has done well. He's kept it from Dante. Ramos. Isco. Rolled through here for Cristiano Ronaldo. Gennaglio. Sprawled at his feet and did enough. Safe penalty in there as well. Isco. Danilo. And Bale. Right-footed, instinctive, and again over. Instinctive it was, you know, pity couldn't cushion that onto his left foot.
and he'll take it onto his right and on the half volley over the bar Europa League tomorrow evening from uh, quarter past seven as we've seen this save from Bernalio he did very well to uh, block out the light Borussia Dortmund against Liverpool at the Westfalen Stadion is on BT Sport Europe and you won't want to miss that the alternative is a Spanish derby Bilbao against Sevilla BT Sport Good again by Arnold moved on here for Bruno Enrique he didn't get zest behind his shot Marcelo's all over. Uh, making a defensively inclined change here Trash is a fullback who will soon be with us whipped in and over by Tony Close once more to sit there in your right back position and look after Gareth Bale, never mind getting forward. Real Madrid twice as many passes, a whole lot more possession, but two goals down and now further frustrated by an unwanted pitch invader. He's not especially appreciated by many, but he's having his moment. And that is the end of his evening. Those who go, Cruiser, Draxler, Cruiser, he's got in, he's drawn a save from Navas, and uh, Villarino lets it bounce behind for a corner. I'll tell you what he did as well, Pitti stayed on his feet, you see he goes past, the defender so well, but we've got to say, good save from Navas stayed on his feet, wanting to score a goal, trying to curl it for that far corner. Forward by Navas, up gets Naldo one more time. Wolfsburg are halfway to paradise. What a night for Dieter Hecking and for all who smile at this club. For Zinedine Zidane, an acceptance and acknowledgement that that won't do for Wolfsburg more than enough this place has never had a night like it yes it went their way in the first half yes the penalty was kind but Rodriguez tucked it away Maxi Arnold doubled the lead on 25 minutes and from there on in despite Ronaldo despite Benzema despite Bale you have to say Wolfsburg were comfortable of course the second leg is a whole new mountain to climb but they have a base camp a sure base camp and they have a belief that goes with it it is deliciously set for the Bernabeu after the first leg in Germany extraordinarily it is Wolfsburg 2 Real Madrid nil Thank you very much to Peter and Robbie. Great scenes there in the Wolfsburg Arena and a massive defeat for Real Madrid and Zinedine Zidane. Ronaldo's face saying it all as he walked off the pitch there. Los Blancos coming crashing down to earth following the highs of that El Clasico win at the weekend. It is their first quarter-final defeat in the Champions League since 2004. But what a night for Dieter Hecking's men. That's five out of five at home in the Champions League. And the good news for him and his side, only eight teams in the history of...